I hacked into the security cameras, and I've got bad news. Atrocitus, the leader of the Red Lanterns, is inside the main building, attempting to destroy the emotional dampener. You can use the Star Labs repulsors in there to help with his followers, but he's way too strong for it to affect him. Scans show Atrocitus is tucked tail and run, but I'm sure he'll be back. Vice was picked up by the good guys and is probably on his way to the science cells on Oa. Star Labs can finish their emotional dampener, and, more importantly, we got a good look at some of their most secretive technology. Looks like Star Labs has created some sort of repulsor device that's triggered by high levels of emotion. I doubt it's powerful enough to work on all Red Lanterns, but it should keep most of them away. Find the explosives cache in the middle of the base and bomb the Red Lantern's batteries. That should be enough to weaken them. The emotional spectrum has gone haywire and it's affecting the different Lantern cores. I've got intel that Star Labs is working on an emotional dampener at Ferris Aircraft Base in Coast City, but the Red Lanterns have attacked the project. Sounds like an opportunity to get an inside look at Star Labs' latest research, and to thrash some of the Sinestro Corps' enemies, the Red Lanterns. Get to Ferris Aircraft. Atrocitus is practically overflowing with rage. If you can find a way to supercharge one of the repulsors, it may give you the edge you need. With those batteries weakened, you should have an easier time with the remaining Red Lanterns. Except for Vice. For a big walking banana head, he's one scary rage-filled lantern. He's too strong for the repulsor. You'll need to take him down the old-fashioned way.